Hello, fellow diamond painting addicts, and welcome back to Diamond Painting Anonymous. I'm Daphne, and I'm here today uh, to share with you one of my new to me companies that I realized I hadn't shared with you yet. Before I jump in though, if you do a couple of things for me, if you'd hit that like button and hit that subscribe button, both of those help me out a lot. You can check the description box below for links to my Facebook page and my Facebook group. Would love to see you both of those places. And you can follow me over on Instagram at Diamond Painting Anonymous. Okay, let's jump in. This is one of the canvases that I got from a new to me company. It is from Mary's Diamonds. And I got this kit because I liked it and I thought my daughter would like it as well. Turns out she doesn't like it so much, but I still think it's a cute kit and it was a new to me company, so I'm still gonna do it. So this is called uh, Zero Two, and I have no idea how you pronounce this artist's name and I don't wanna slaughter it, so I'm not even going to try. Um, it is a square 50 by 70. So let's open it and find out what's in it, shall we? I can get the box open here. So I've seen lots of people do Mary's Diamonds, but I had never done one before, so I was kind of curious to see what all was in here. Make sure I got everything out of the box. Okay. So I already like the canvas. It's nice and soft. It's that soft lint. Cute little ribbon, branded ribbon, says Mary's Diamonds on it. And... Let's unroll this. I'm gonna, gonna unroll it this way. I saw this one and my daughter really likes anime manga type stuff. And so I thought this was kind of her style, you know, kind of um, that anime style. But when I asked her about it, just not her thing. She does like the anime style of it, but just not something that she wanted to hang up in her house, which is what I was getting it for. So, okay, so we've got our drills here. We can see we get a big boat. That's a big boat. Four squares of wax. We get our pin with a four placer and a 10 placer in there. Some nice gold tweezers, a scrunchie on the pen. So a little nicer than your average tool kit. You can see our drills here. I see some ABs already. So let's unroll the canvas and see what it looks like. Oh, this is a portrait one. So I don't know if I'm going to, how much of it I'm going to get in the, f I'll put a, a picture over there of the artwork so you can see it. Um, but it's just this really pretty uh, kind of anime style girl. It's got her hands up in the air, you can see, and it's got all these kind of wind wisp flowers blowing around and everything. And I just really like the color scheme of it. I thought it was really pretty. So this is, what did I say, a 50 by 70. So let's measure and see. It is 50 across. So some trucker is honking their horn. I hope you can't hear that. 50 by 70. So that is the actual size of the drill field, which is nice. Always like it when that's the size of the drill field. And trying to look here at all of the uh, symbols and see if there's anything that I think would give me any issues. So we do have a schematic on both sides. We've got one up here at the top and it does have the DMC colors along with the symbols. And there is also one down here at the bottom, same way. Um, it's got, I'm assuming these four at the end have an A after the number, so I'm assuming those are ABs, so four ABs. So you can see here the, the branding on the bottom for their Facebook and Instagram. If you want to tag, whenever you're working on something, if you tag, uh, companies. They love that. There's looks like there's some kind of QR code up there. And yeah, I don't know, probably not as good as the thumbnail that I'm going to stick in there. But 
just really I really like the color scheme of it the pinks and the blues and the 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 palette of it and really like kind of the motion of the painting so I'm really curious to see how this goes so it is nice and sticky but I can see that the glue goes clear up to here so there's about an inch of extra glue there at the top it doesn't look like there's that much extra on the sides so that's good but I definitely will want to washi tape this okay so let me see if that kit will hold that in place I don't want this to go anywhere and let's get in the drills we do have an inventory sheet so then it has a little bit of a bigger picture on it so I can show you what the artwork looks like. I'm not gonna inventory everything right now, but I will get the drills out to show you. And I just threw a whole bunch of them in the floor, so. And like I said, this is a square kit. This is one that I probably won't get to until next year, but that's okay. I have lots of projects I need to finish out this year, um, and I have some ideas for projects I wanna do next year, so it's okay that this one will be next year. So here is the inventory sheet. Here you can see a little better image. As I said, 50 by 70, we've got 44 colors, and then we've got our inventory sheet here with the symbols, the DMC color, how many of each, and then the weight of each one. So like I said, I'm not gonna inventory each one. I'm just gonna kind of look at the drills and show them to you. So I will say these, I can see lots of dimples on the bottom of these drills, but that is a very pretty kind of deep purple mulberry color. And we've got this kind of really pale blue. We've got a gray, a dark gray. Ooh, that's a very dark turquoise. That's very pretty. And then we've got kind of a light turquoise. We've got a red. We've got a bright pink. I like that color, that's a good color. We've got a blue. Oh, we've got a couple of escape drills here. Let me. We've got a gray. We've got another kind of blush pink. Kind of a pale mauve. There's a stowaway in there. Ooh, see, this is what I mean about these blues. Look at that vibrant kind of peacock turquoise oh beautiful another kind of dark mauve another blue kind of a dusky pink a blush pink as Shelby would say uh, oh you guys look there's a round one in there that stowed away uh, here's another kind of Dusky Rose, Oop, there I see an AB, I'm getting there. Let me get these floaters out of the way. Okay, here's another kind of baby blue, a dark blue. This is kind of a dark purplish blue. We've got another kind of reddish mauve. Ooh, this pretty like watermelon color love that one we've got another kind of mulberry Ooh, look at that this is all of the black that drill is sitting in the top so i'm just going to pull that out of there that's all the black in this whole kit that's amazing love that for me another kind of berry pink love these pinks and blues another very light pink and then we've got a very dark purple, a medium purple, a light purple. We've got another gray, 
a kind of a what, slate blue almost. And then we've got a light blue. And then we've got another, whoo, look how full this bag is. And there's one sitting in the top. So let me get that one out. This bag is super full, but love that light blue color. And then we've got a light gray, another kind of greenish turquoise, another light blue, a kind of mauvey purple. We, whoop, there's another loose drill. We've got another kind of dark pink. We've got another kind of greenish turquoise. And then we've got our four ABs, you guys. Okay, 820, look at these purple ABs. Those are gorgeous. Love how those look. And then we've got these pink ABs. These are so pretty. Loving those. And then, oh, I missed just some purple, a dark purple. And then, ooh, look at this Christmas red AB. Those are super pretty. My favorite red. And then just some white ABs with a green straggler. So four ABs in this kit. That's pretty nice. I didn't realize it came with that many. You know me, I just look at the painting and if I like it, then I get it. I don't really pay a whole lot of attention, even though I should to the size or how many colors or how many ABs. Mostly I don't pay attention to how many ABs because I figure, you know, I can always buy ABs and add those in myself. You can always add enhancements uh, to your pictures and really, you know, kind of make them more personalized that way. So I've ordered from several different companies to get uh, kind of a, a, some stock of ABs built up. I need to order some more. And I've got several of my colors kind of stashed away at the moment in a kit that I'm not working on yet. It's kitted up, so I put the ABs with it, but I haven't actually started working on the kit yet. So. I really should probably grab them back out. I'm going to stick this back in here so that my inventory sheet doesn't get lost. Okay. Let me wrap these back up. is always the fun part, isn't it? Trying to get everything put back together. So, yeah. So 40 some colors, a decent kit, and look at this canvas. It's so pretty. I actually am really excited to get started on this one now that I've kind of pulled it out and looked at it. It'll go back in the box until next year when I have time to work on it because I've got plenty of other projects to keep me busy through the end of this year. But yeah, I really like how this one looks. So super happy with this one. Uh, as usual, I will put a link in the description box down below to this item and you can check it out for yourself or anything else you might see while you're there. Uh, I know she had several uh, paintings by this particular artist and she always has uh, some really interesting things so go check it out before you leave guys don't forget to do all the things if you like this video give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and hit that bell notification icon so that you can be informed of future uploads and as always guys thanks so much for watching